There we go, fish on. What do we got? Shiner. There's my first fish, Shiner. Let's see if we can get a look at him. It's going kind of crazy. Yeah, there we go. Look at this guy. Common Shiner, about six inches. If there are huge bass in here, this would make a good bait. We're gonna let him go though. Welcome back to Realistic Fishing. I'm out here fishing a creek with Seth. What's up, everybody? I'm closer to Nashville today. I took about an hour drive to get here. Let's see if we can get anything else besides a shiner. Seth's got a fish already. What do you got? Small mouth. A small, small mouth bass. Let's check it out. Yeah, that's a good looking fish. Cool. There we go, fish on. Long ear sunfish. Second fish of the day. Pretty good size. Nice and bright. Went for that gulp minnow on a jig head. What do you think? I don't know, is it getting deeper? It's getting deeper. What's back this way? Uh, back this way is a, oh, it's not deep like this, but it's a long stretch. Yeah, we could try, we, we could try it. Fish on. Fish on, what do we got? It's jumping. It's a bass. Small mouth. Cool. Got him on that gulp minnow on a jig head. Let's get up here so we can get him unhooked. There we go. Look at the color on this guy brown right this is definitely not the kind of fish i typically catch i usually catch largemouth bass so this one's pretty cool still got a really big mouth for a small mouth let's let him go hi this is debbie i'm in cat spring texas you're watching realistic fishing keep it realistic that's one smallmouth for me, one for Seth. I think I got a shiner and a long ear, and he also got a green sunfish. Let's keep going. I'm fishing with a gulp minnow. He's fishing with a helgramite. Yeah, I'll show you again real quick. This is what I caught him on. I caught a leaf. A lot of leaves flowing down the creek here. Fall, it's fall. Fish on. Oh, the fish came off and I ended up with a stick. I had a bite for sure. 
something small, probably a sunfish. Oh, again. Got him that time. Yeah, sunfish, I think. Oh, bluegill. Third species of the day. Long ear, smallmouth bass, bluegill, and a shiner. I guess that's my fourth. I don't know if that was a fish or a snag. Fish on, what do we got? Another small one. Bluegill. Guess I found a school of bluegill down there. Five incher. My name's Emma. Always keep it realistic. Fish on. What do we got? Looks like a long ear. Sure is. Good looking fish. Once again, gulp minnow. Another one. Probably a long ear. It's not jumping like a bass. Bluegill. Pretty good size for a creek. Yeah, good size bluegill here. There's a little fish. What do we got? Long ear. Another long ear here. Can you hear that helicopter in the background? All right, let's see if we can get up through here. It don't look so bad, as long as I don't step on any snakes. Yeah, right here, we're going for it. Ah. All right, my legs are kind of numb from all the cold water. We're gonna walk down the sidewalk here, down the path to a different spot. Hi, I'm John from Northern Grit, and you're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. Oh, is that a little bass? Small man. All right. Oh yeah. That one's more of a yellow, kind of light colored. That's a good one. Yeah. There's a little green sunfish down here.
got him. <laughs> Just a little guy. Little greeny. How many species is that for me today? Five? Let's count them. Green sunfish. Long-eared sunfish. Shiner. Bluegill. Smallmouth bass. So yeah, Seth turned around and went back this way. I'm going to go this way. I got a long drive. Not too bad. Got what, five species of fish? Pretty good for a new creek. Happy to get that smallmouth today. Oh, mud. Mud. <laughs> Sliding. <laughs> 